cleaning, knife sharpening whetstones from unusable to as new in eight minutes. Hi, my name is Glenn Thompson. Now, I'm a good few years past my use-by date, so I've placed a 20-year-old photograph of myself at the bottom of the screen so that you may almost see who I am. Now, like many people, I use whetstones to sharpen and maintain my knives and various tools. And as many of you would know, whetstones clog up with the steel shavings from the knife or other tool which you are sharpening or maintaining. Now, as many of you will see, I am using a Ruixon Pro knife sharpening system, which I am sure was designed by an accountant who was intent on saving every micro cent possible in production costs. Now, as many of you will know, whetstones become clogged up and become effectively glazed by the steel shavings which become embedded in the face of the whetstone. And when this occurs, the whetstone becomes entirely ineffective. So, I am now going to demonstrate the fastest and best method of cleaning your whetstones to the point where, that, where they are effectively like brand new and as far as I am aware this is the first time that this method has been demonstrated for cleaning whetstones. Now the first thing to do is just give it a quick rinse just to get all the, uh, the fine dust off. Now, my secret weapon is this ultrasonic cleaner, which is sold by every, um, or by many Australian tool shops. Now, what I do, I, first of all, I simply use um, kitchen detergent. I've brought it up to, up to temperature, and I've degassed the water. Now, to make it work properly, I've, I simply suspend the, um, the wet stone from uh, from rubber bands, so that the face so that the face of the whetstone is down into the uh, uh, towards the ultrasonic transducer. Now I set it to its maximum uh, cycle time and run it. Now, as you can probably see, or at least I hope you can see. Uh, you can already see material, the, uh, the uh, dirt coming off the whetstone. Now I'll fast uh, run the uh, video so you're not bored and twiddling your thumbs for the next five or six minutes. Okay, so that's the end of one, one cycle of 480 seconds. So we'll just take the um, whetstone out and, and have a look. Now, as you can see, that has become essentially like brand new. In order that you can appreciate the difference, I have placed a before and after photograph on the screen. Now, this method can be used for all types of whetstones, and it absolutely does not damage them in any way at all. Now, this is my very first video on the knife and tool sharpening to topic. I normally produce material which exposes high level crime and corruption, particularly corruption in the so-called justice system of Victoria, Australia. So, if you're interested in high level crime and corruption, click the link to the video which will come on the screen in a few seconds. In addition, 
Please like and share this video and, subscri and subscribe to my channel. I may be tempted to provide more, sharp, more knife sharpening tips. Thank you. The end.